Lijep pozdrav iz Slovenije. Hello, I'm Teja Hlačer, ceramic artist from Slovenia. I um, admire, I like clay a lot. Uh, I started shaping clay since I was a child. I'm also a cultural anthropologist. Um, this is the study I did because in Slovenia, we, since a few years ago, we didn't have really official um, school for becoming a, a potter or a ceramic artist. So this is the main study I did and then beside it I always took uh, classes in art, in painting also and uh, especially for ceramics and pottery. I was so admired when I saw a traditional potter making a shape like a, like a musician on the wheel from a small bowl of clay he made suddenly a shape appeared and this for me as a child was so magical and this is, I said wow if I could do this so I'm so happy that I can work on the wheel and enjoy making all these shapes and uh, feel clay be connected to the earth to our mother earth to the elementary the material that is so um, so natural and so uh, it has so many possibilities in it it's given to us it can be shaped it can be fired and when it's fired it's uh, more or less permanent and this clay how we find we find it in the after thousands of years it's still there and we find it as archaeologists and we see, wow, what, what was done with it so many years ago. I'm researching clay as the material. I'm also very fond of our um, traditional ceramics. So I do research on that and also on the um, traditional techniques and forms, how our ceramics developed over time and also use all this knowledge to do the contemporary ceramics and to, to, do, um, to find my own expression in it. I live in a region in Slovenia that is, has a lot of stones in the, also in the forest, different formations and this inspires me also to do my works and it's um, the landscape or the... I always um, take the ins inspirations from nature and uh, I find it's, it's never ending <laughs> these inspirations and also I like uh, to be inspired by the artifacts by uh, ancient, ancient forms, ancient stories, myths, mythology uh, it's so rich our history and also somehow it's, it's always evolving and always somehow it's in, coming in circles and we can feel how, how people felt before in the, in the past and the shapes they did, they come from their necessity, that's how they lived, they needed ceramics uh, for their kitchen, uh, for the food to cook, for the, for the drinking, for, um, uh, for eating from it, for serving. So clay was always present in our lives and is still today. And I find that today is, is also very precious and very important that we have it and use it in our daily lives or, or just using it and to drink from, from the cups or uh, ceramic cups or to cook in ceramic um, dishes and also to use it as a um, therapeutic material, especially in our modern way of life. Thank you, Wa Woman, for inviting me and uh, giving me this opportunity to show my work, to present myself 
and I send greetings to India and around the world.